Hey guys, so in this video, I'm replacing my OEM grill that I have on my TRD Off-Road Premium Tacoma. So that includes a camera. So I'm changing my grill out to a heritage style grill and I'm gonna show you some of the key features to look for when you're replacing your whole camera system and moving that radar sensor down. Let's get into it. So I have the two grills here. This grill over here is by Yodiverse and I have the camera attachment for it by Taco Vinyl. The camera attachment is right here. So we are going to be placing the full camera. This is the front camera for the whole 360 system. And we're also going to be taking the radar sensor and moving that down here, which this is all provided with the kit. So before I do that, I'm going to go ahead and take the camera out, just some Phillips heads, and I'm going to take the radar sensor out too. You could use either a socket, probably a 10 millimeter, or a Phillips head too to take the radar sensor out. No sense in unplugging it because this is part of the frame for the grill. So I'm just gonna take the radar out and place it over the side. Okay, so I removed everything for the radar sensor. There was the two 10 millimeter bolts or you could use a Phillips screw. The Phillips screw right here, there was one that went there. And then I just used some pliers to pull this tab out. But now with all this loose, we'll just go ahead and place it over the side. We will take these dudes out and we will transfer those over here to hold that radar sensor in and we will use those same 10 millimeter bolts I used to secure it. Okay, now with them moved to the side, like I said, we're gonna be focusing on these tabs here, but there's also these little black screws all throughout this that you're going to want to loosen. So you just see these little black screws throughout we're just gonna go ahead and loosen all of them. Okay, and now with all those screws out, we're gonna focus on the tabs. So as you can see, these tabs, they wanna fall down when you start to separate the grill. So the grill is coming out of the housing, so when you find some pressure with some tab, like when you get to right here, you just push the tab down, push the tab down, it has like that little brace right there. So just push that in, push the tab down and the grill will fall forward. Okay, and now with all those tabs loose, as you can see, the grill just separates from the color surround. Now we'll go ahead and take our heritage style grill, gonna set it down right here, and then we'll take our housing, set it over top, line up those tabs, and set it together. All right, and quick thing to note, all those screws over here that you took out to take the original grill out, they're not gonna go back in just the way that this one's made. So definitely make sure that all your tabs are through because when you put a screw through here, it just falls. I seem to have misplaced my screws for the Toyota Heritage uh, emblem right here. So I just reused those screws right here to screw that in to secure that. And we also have the radar sensor secured in as well. Now it is time to remount the camera. Okay, and if you flip the grill around, you're gonna notice this right here. This is where we are going to put the camera. So I just grabbed a pair of dikes. I'm gonna clean this up a little bit, but dress, I just grabbed a pair of dikes, cut this out because our camera is basically gonna cover this whole area. Okay, and now I'm gonna take off the 3M adhesive and when you stick it in here, it's gonna basically sit like this. Now, this grill is from Yodiverse and this is from Taco Vinyl, but on Taco Vinyl's website, it shows that their screws are in a little bit more, so it will, so it will really work with their grill probably the best. This is just the avenue that I went down uh, not realizing that I needed uh, the camera cut out basically too. So I'm just gonna put some because it kind of rests on these, but it doesn't really go on it that well. So I'm just gonna put some solid tape here for myself, and then that 3M adhesive sh should stick pretty well up here. We are also going to have to take the camera off of its old bracket. You just simply disconnect the connector, take off these two small little screws, and then we will put it to this connector and thread it through those two holes right there. So really solid bracket, it lines up as you can see, so you don't gotta worry about, oh crud, is this right side up or wrong side down, whatever it is, so it all lines up perfectly, so it should be right side up. Okay, and not the prettiest work, but nothing will be showing from the front, so I just duct taped it down. Seems pretty solid. The 3M adhesive there 
uh, on the front really, really helps. And then there's a little notch right here to reroute all your wires. So everything's plugged in, should be ready to go. Let's get it onto the Tacoma. Man, that looks good. All right, and there we have it. The Yodaverse grill is installed with the camera bracket from Taco Vinyl. And to take this grill off, guys, it's super easy. It's just the little plastic piece right here in the light, one 10 millimeter, another 10 millimeter, and another one right here in the light. And then the grill just shimmies itself off. But man, what a difference this is in the front of the Tacoma versus this grill here. What a difference, that's crazy. So guys, if you're new around here and you like install videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. Returning subscribers as always, I appreciate your guys' support and I will catch you in the next video. All right, see you later. Thank you.